I guess I just want them to know that I'm like a pretty happy person. I enjoy life. I like everyone. I mean, I think everyone deserves a chance for everything. So I feel like I'm a pretty easygoing person. And I like when they know that because I like people to be comfortable around me. I like them to know that I'm a hard worker and I try and do the best in what I do. With a family, like a husband and some kids. I want to be a pharmacist, so hopefully I'll be working some cool hospital somewhere. I'd love to live on a coast, either the east or the west, I don't know which one yet, but we'll see. That might take a few more years than 10. But that's where I'd like to see myself. I'd like to be traveling and just living comfortably with my life. Teachers, like, they're pretty close to you. I think that's what I like the best, actually. They'll really get to know you and take their time out of their day to, like, talk to you. Or if they see you walking down the hall and you're just, like, in a really bad mood, they'll actually, like, talk to you and they care and you can tell. They're not, it's not just, like, part of their job. Probably just spending the last year like making a bunch of memories with everyone. After senior year, I kind of just want to move on and get away and start a new life completely different from right now. And I don't know where I'll end up or like where I want to end up. I don't know if it'll be close to here. So that's what I'm looking forward to just having a really good time with my friends and family. I'm gonna miss the freedom of not getting to do whatever I want all the time. I can't just go out on a run and come back home and sit down and like eat the food my parents bought me. <laughs> I'll have to like go out, do my job, buy my own stuff. I think that's what I'm gonna miss most honestly. It's just that kind of like that reassurance that there's always something there for you. <laughs> Once you're out of college, you're kind of on your own. <laughs> Not to expect things and don't think you're entitled to anything. Like my parents taught me if you want something, you have to work for it. You can't just expect it to happen. And I think that's the most important, like I think that's what's gotten me to the point I am today and like got me all the things that I enjoy because I don't just sit around and wait for them. I go out and make it happen if I can. Never give up in yourself 
or other people. Things happen and people do stuff that really pisses you off sometimes or you might make yourself mad and you just want to give up but that's like the point where you just gotta keep going and you know look past all the bad stuff and look into the future. You know someday it's gonna get better. putting up with me for 18 years. I know it's been tough, but I'd like to thank you for literally everything. I know that I'm a very full of attitude girl, but no matter what, you guys always love me and you always try and make my day. I thank you for supporting everything I do, especially my running. Like, if there's something that I want, you guys don't even think twice about it. You just go in and you help me through it. Thank you for taking me at throughout the world. That's probably one of my favorite things is thank you for like allowing me to travel and see the beauty of the world. Thanks for being my parents and thanks for not letting me be one of those deadbeat bums that just sits around the house and plays video games or mopes about life all day. So hopefully I can repay you someday. <laughs> thank you. I love you guys so much.